Welcome back. In the previous video, we were able to fetch all income and then fetch a single income. So what I'm going to do in this video is to implement, update and delete. So let's get started. All right. So inside the project, let's collapse all this one from here and this one too as well. So server, first I'll see controllers, income and income. <laughs> okay so nice comment comment here and say first of all update and going to be also pretty simple and easy to implement all right so first of all let's create the function so const update income inc controller and express async handler and then async rec and response and our arrow function all right so here let's get started and for the id for update to you need a particular id of the income that you want to update right so let's get that one from the rec.params as we did for here so let's copy that copy that and paste it here all right so there we go so this one too we need the things you want to update so also we need when you're creating it let's grab what you are getting from the body and paste it here <laughs> so here we don't update the user right okay so for the update we have this title amount description because the user can choose to update the title or amount or description it's up to the user oh sorry not here, not here, not here. Here, here, here. My update. Okay. So now we have two ingredients. The one, the ID means the particular post I want to, sorry, the particular income I want to update and the things I want to update with. That is title, amount, and description, right? So here, here comes the magic. So try and catch. Try and catch me if I go wrong, all right? Okay, so here comes, let's assign the return value coming from the update as await. This time around is find by ID and update. So the, the difference here we're doing here just like MongoDB methods. Right. So here, find by ID take two things. Or let me say three things. Right. One, the ID you want to the, the the income that you want to find by id next is the things you want to update with that's query options so let's expand that and one the title description and amount that is it so the last argument here to this function is what provide additional preferred code new Meaning that you want to return the updated version of the income that you what you updated. And that is all what we need. So let's send the income. <laughs> that is all. We are done. You'll be shocked. You'll be asked, whoa, why? Why is it so easy like that? So here, rest.json and JSON here. And then let's some error. Last thing, let's export this. So update income controller and let's go to the income route income route and the same thing is called the update and update in controller okay so this time around let's copy one of these ones and for update the method is called put right so let me put it here put like that and you also need the id and then the function here is called update in controller and that is all what i need that is all what i need so let's go to postman and then try it out so let's copy one of these ones paste it and let's change this one to update and here the method is called put and the id you want to update for now let's send something and let's see the error not found because there's no endpoint with a put with this endpoint so something like id 
we see that hey yes i meet and now you see it give me error again cast to id field because these are a valid id all right so let's try to fit this single single okay fetch single to id this is weird no it's a lie so let's fetch single and let's see oh okay i got it so now let's update this one so let's grab this id and let's go to update let's save it see this icon put this here and let's put it here as that all right and let's send and there we go you see so now let's change my title to something else so let's change here my salary too and the amount is gonna be nine thousand dollars and description is my income too and the same user all right so the user here i think the user is not so let's send and we see that we have it we have the id the description my income to a nine thousand so our update to is working so the last thing to implement is delete and also simple right all right so for delete it's, it's even easier than the, the rest of the one right so for the delete let's go ahead and do that also find by id and delete that is all find by id and delete so where is it let's copy the single one because it's going to be the same thing copy the single fetch details and then let's come here and say delete and paste it and let's change this one to delete ink ink controller and ink that is it so here you want to find the particular post you want to delete right and you can get it from the params as we have the id so here we're gonna be find by id and delete and delete and that is it i'm done with it guys i'm done with it so let's export this export this and paste it like that so let's go to the route and then here is delete the whole difference here gonna be the method you see how we stretch application make our life easier and here gonna be delete and that is it so let's go back to postman and try it out let's let's copy one of these and which one should we delete hey they'll be saying oh please don't delete me oh i'm so important but i'll delete you so now let's select delete so let's delete this one so whatever we delete for delete, you can send just a message that, hey, hey, Charlie, um, this post has been deleted, but I want to send the deleted, remove this one, I want to send the deleted income. So that's what I'm sending back to the user. Maybe you can see that, oh, this income with this title has been deleted in the front end, depending how you want to implement it. So let me delete. I delete it. Oh, Charlie, it's gone. <laughs> it's so sad. This amount is gone this huge money but it's gone so now that it's been deleted if you go back and fetch that it doesn't exist when i get now and that is it <laughs> oh god it's all right so it's working delete and update create and fake details are all working perfectly so the next video we are going to implement the expenses and we are going to copy yes even copy the whole of these ones the difference is that change the model and that is it guys and that is it so let's do that one in the next video